Good day everyone, my name is Andy and welcome to the Siren Head Dating Simulator. I decided to start my day with a walk in the woods. There's an abandoned railroad track behind my house. It's perfect for walks. People use it often, but lately I haven't seen anyone around. Is it because of the bees? What? A siren sound? It's rare to get a tornado around here. Suddenly. Out of nowhere. We fall to the ground. S -s Siren head? This is it. Th this is how I die. God damn it. No, it can't end like this. I just wanted ice cream. I just wanted ice cream. Siren head stops, stares at you deeply into your eyes, reading you from top to bottom, feeling your soul, stealing your heart. Siren head lifts you up and gives you a nice overview of the forest. Wow, this, this view, it's, it, it's beautiful. You and Siren Head walk off to an ice cream store. <laughs> oh, do you, do you want some ice cream too, Siren Head? You assume he's saying, yes, I would very much like some ice cream, Andy. <laughs> okay, let's, let's order some. The ice cream man looks at you both with a terrified look. <laughs> What flavor would you like? I'm gonna go with some good old chocolate. Chocolate, please. Siren Head slowly turns his head towards you. Uh-oh. You don't know what he's saying. But you think it's somewhere along the lines of, What the fuck? You know I'm allergic to chocolate. You fucked up. Your head explodes and you die. And then Siren Head dies from a chocolate allergy. <laughs> I hope you're happy, you monster. <laughs> what are you talking about? All right, I'm gonna go with some good old vanilla. Vanilla, please. Siren Head slowly turns his head towards you. Uh-oh. You don't know what he's saying. But you assume he's saying, I can't believe you're such a basic bitch to order vanilla ice cream. <laughs> You fucked up. Your head explodes and you die. Game over. Alright, fine. I'll go with strawberry. Strawberry, please. You have no idea what he said. But you think it's somewhere along the lines of, I would like strawberry too, please. It's what I heard too. You, if, you, if you listen closely, you can actually hear it. Siren Head puts his ice cream into his mouth. <laughs> oh, there's actually... <laughs> oh, that's so great. He seems to be enjoying it. <laughs> so wait. Does that mean that when I was walking through the forest and he was making those woo sounds? Does that mean he was enjoying himself? Does that mean he liked it? He was having fun running through the woods and then he saw me and all of a sudden all the fun went away? Is that what went on? God damn it. I uncovered your secret, you little shit. Yeah, well, you're 40 feet tall shit, actually. You have no idea what he said, but you think it's somewhere along the lines of, please, tell me your life story. Wow. Uh, on the first date? Sure, I'll tell you. Well, I had a really happy childhood. Except for one thing. When I was young, my dog ran away and, and never came home. I miss him. Siren Head stays quiet for a second. Until... Sparky! You sound just like him! Wait a minute. <laughs> Does that mean you killed my dog, you bastard? No, I'll say that's adorable. He's doing his best. He didn't know. He was just hungry, right? Yeah, sure. Nobody's ever done something so thoughtful for me. Siren Head stays silent for a moment. He starts blushing. <laughs> you feel yourself start blushing as well. Is, is this what love feels like? This was a lovely date, Siren Head. I hope we can hang out again soon. I know, I know, I know, I had a lovely time as well. We'll see each other again soon, don't worry about it. You have no idea what he just said, but you think it's somewhere along the lines of, I love you. I love you too, Siren Head. I love you too.
I was just enjoying my jazz. You, you, n never, never cut off a man's jazz. You listen to me, all right? Never, never, ever cut off a man's jazz, all right? Not when he's vibing to it, all right? Huh. <laughs> Sorry, I had a little moment of weakness right there. Well, uh, I guess that was our date with Siren Head. I personally think we're gonna go on a second date together, you know? We had a, we had a lovely time. We got some ice cream. Uh, it killed me twice, but uh, I made the right decision in the end. It all went by smoothly. And I can't wait for a second date with my lovely Siren Head. But I want to thank you all for accompanying me on my date with Siren Head. If you enjoyed this date as much as I did, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe. Share this video or any of my other videos with people uh, you like or you don't like or whatever. I really don't care. Just share it and I, I love you. Maybe even as much as Sirenet. Maybe even more. Ring that notification bell if you want to get notified whenever I upload something. Or otherwise, Sirenhead might not go on a date with you. You don't want that to happen, do you? You want a date with Sirenhead as well. I can see it in your eyes. I saw it the entire time. You were jealous of me. I know it. Don't worry, you'll get your chance. Because the link to this game will be in the description. You can play it for yourself and maybe you'll even get a different outcome. You know? Maybe you'll even marry on your first date. Maybe you'll have sex on your first date. For a split second, I just imagined what sex would be like with Siren Head. I uh, need therapy now. And then I hope to see you all again in the next video. Have a wonderful day. Or evening. Or Easter. Or Christmas. Or whatever the fuck. I don't know. All right, just leave me alone, all right? Just, I, I, I'll, I'll get it. I'm going, all right? You, you can have your date now, all right? You have your date with Siren Head. It's fine. I get it, all right? I'll leave the room. I'll, I'll leave the room. Fine. Fine.